Today we will be answering a question from exam 1, part 3, question 5D. So our first step to addressing this question is by reading the problem. And the problem is asking to find the amount of force from Q3 on Q0 with the following information. So now we can go on to step 2, which is identifying the what. So what do we know? Well, we know that the charge of Q3 is positive 3.2 times 10 to the negative 4 coulombs. We also know that the charge of Q0 is equal to negative 1.1 times 10 to the negative 4 coulombs. And we also know that the K constant is equal to 8.99 times 10 to the 9 SI units. We also know, based off of our exam, that the distance between Q0 and Q3 is negative 1 meter. Now that we have all of this information, we can move on to step 3, which is asking us to identify the correct equation to use. For this problem, we can use Fc is equal to the k constant times the absolute value of q0 times the absolute value of q3 over r squared. Now, we can plug all of the values that we have from the what do we know section into this equation. After plugging all of these numbers into my calculator, I am left with an answer of 316.45 newtons per coulomb, which can be translated in scientific notation as 3.1645 times 10 squared newtons per coulomb. And that, my friends, is the final answer.